look what just came in the mail. Uh, I pre-ordered these books because I made a video explaining on my main channel why these books are so important for Star Wars. First of all, this is an era set before the prequels. It's an era of stories never been explored in Star Wars before with characters we know nothing about and they're going to expand upon. Now, if you've never gotten on the Star Wars books, this is the best opportunity because it's a whole new era of canon that you don't have to know anything about to read. And so now's your chance to do it. And so I, you know, as someone who wanted to get into them, I wasn't really sure. I saw this as my opportunity. I jumped on my opportunity, pre-ordered the books, and I got them here. Uh, these came out uh, January 5th. Um, they did not show up January 5th. It is a, a, it's about it's January 7th two days later These were actually slated to come Monday, which I found ridiculous, but instead they, they got them to me quicker Thank you Amazon because seriously I pre-order things to get them on Release day or even a day after release day But like a whole week later would have been ridiculous <laughs> for something I pre-ordered so the first one I pre-ordered is A Test of Courage. Now, um, look at the size of this. I don't own a single book that's the size of this. I do love the art on this. This is pretty great. Um, I don't know anything about it. I haven't read it. I've, I've, I've seen some reviews. But these were all early, early reviews, so they couldn't talk about spoilers or any of that. I don't want any spoilers. I want to read these, you know. Uh, but um, people... People were saying, so this is the younger kids, like 8 to 12, kind of in that range, maybe a little bit older, kind of novel. And I've heard that this novel, which is teen to young adult kind of aimed book, um, I heard these two, if you read this first and go into this, they kind of flow together. And so I was like, well, I'm going to buy both and read them uh, because this one, uh, it was going at about 30, 26 bucks when it first went up for pre-order, but it went down to about 18 bucks, which for this book, great deal. Um, I love the art on this too. Uh, here's the back. It says, for over thousands of generations, the Jedi Knights were the guardians of peace and justice. So, what to see um, about that. Here's the back of this. It says, long before the Clone Wars, the Empire, or the First Order, First Order, the Jedi lit the way for the galaxy in a golden age known as the High Republic. Interesting. And I'm not going to read the rest of this because it's a plot description. And maybe you don't want to know that, but I do want to read these. Um, let's see. Do these have any art? Does this one have any art in it? That's a question. Oh. There's a timeline in here. It says High Republic. Fall of the Jedi, which is Phantom Menace, Attack of the Clones, Clone Wars, and Revenge of the Sith. Region of the Empire, The Bad Batch and Solo, A Star Wars Story. Age of the Rebellion, Rebels, Rogue One, A New Hope. A New Hope. I don't know why I said like, I don't hope. Uh, Empire Strikes Back, Return of the Jedi. New Republic, The Mandalorian. Rise of the First Order, the Resistance, Resistance, which is Star Wars Resistance, uh, The Force Awakens, Last Jedi, and Rise of Skywalker. So I like that that this is in here explaining that. Um, you can tell that it's aimed at a younger kid stuff because they're trying to explain this as simply as possible. But still, I still think that's pretty cool. Um, here's a prologue in here, chapters. You know, obviously it's aimed at a younger kid. Because most older books... For, well, you know, I don't know. Oh, there is some art in here. That's kind of cool. That's pretty neat. Um, I'm going to make sure, I'm going to check here and make sure, I'm going to check the art before I show you, make sure none of it's like too spoilerific or anything of anything that could possibly happen. Here's that. That's pretty neat. There isn't a ton of art in here, but still, the art in here that is in here is actually pretty neat. I like this art in this book. Um, but yeah, and it's about, where they get a, you get kind of a sneak peek at one of the other, uh, 
Race to Crash Point Tower, which is the next book. Uh, I don't think that one's gone up for pre-order with that title, but now, now that that's good to know. But yeah, I am interested to see where that goes. But this is a 13 chapter book. Um, now this runs about 10, 12 bucks. I pre-ordered it. It was 12 bucks. So um, yeah, I I like this book. It's kind of kind of the art on it and stuff, but. Um, 12 bucks I think is a bit much 10 maybe 8 bucks for this because of the size um, this is a hardcover of course but it's just I don't know about the size with this one um, now this is written uh, by Justina Ireland uh, I have not read any, any of her books but uh, maybe this is her first book I don't know uh, I'll have to look into the author if I like that book uh, we have Charles Sol Salon, um, um, he he's wrote, written many Star Wars books, so this is a so it seems like they caught people that were, uh, you know, actually written for Star Wars and that they really liked. We got that in there. Of course, this one probably won't have any art, if, judging by the other Star Wars books. Um, and here is another timeline. High Republic, Light of the Jedi, Dooku, Jedi Lost, Master of the Apprentice, you know, hmm. Even include some of the games in here in this timeline and some of the characters and some of the other books. That's actually pretty awesome. I, I really, oh, it's Star Wars novels timeline. That's why, that's pretty awesome. So that is neat. You get all the, how many pages in this book? Um, how many chapters? Three hundred and eighty-three pages. Well, in terms of the actual book itself, um, there's actually just 277 pages, but the rest are just like stuff from the author written in the back of the book. But yeah, 18 bucks for this. Uh, that's pretty fair. That's a pretty normal price for these Star Wars hardcover books. Um, but yeah, I think that if you're a fan of, uh, uh, of Star Wars and you want to get into the books, Here's your jumping off point. I think it's great to start checking these out. Uh, you definitely should uh, be looking into these. Uh, but yeah, that is everything I got for you. I'm not sure if I'll be reviewing these on my main channel, uh, but I, I guess it just pretend, uh, depends on how long it takes me to read these. I'm excited to read them. They seem really cool. So yeah.